Welcome back to Tabletop Salt. I'm Ross. I'm David. And today we're going to bring you a 1500 point battle report. I'll be using Stitches 8 Admic. And I'll be using Iron Warriors Chaos Space Marines. Quite excited. Yeah. So today we're going to play Battle Lines. Um, very, very simple. It's got four objectives. You have one in each of your deployment zones, and those deployment zones are Hammer S. Hammer. Shortage, shortage. Yeah, yeah. Sort of shortage, shortage. Um, and then you've got two started around the No Man's Land, kind of as usual. Um, however, you'll score your victory points from Battle Round 2, five victory points if you have one or more objective, another five if you have two or more, and your final five if you have um, more than your opponent, to a maximum of 15 victory points that Battle Round. With that, I guess it's only time to show you our stratagems, or sorry, secondary objectives that we've chosen, and the armies. So here we have my 1500 points of Iron Warriors Chaos Space Marines, and they're coming with the Battalion Detachment today, giving me 12 command points. To play with in this game. Uh, only detachment taken. So leading it will be a Chaos Lord of Jump Pack. Warlord trait will be Siege Master. The Iron Warriors Warlord trait. And I'll just have a basic bolt pistol, frag and crack grenades and a power fist. Second HQ choice will be a Demon Prince with wings of Slanesh. Artifacts of the Iron Warriors will be Insidium. Uh, and I'll have a pair of two Malefic Talons. We then have three troop choices. Three five-man Chaos Space Marine squads. The first squad on the right is just all boat pistols, uh, boat guns, grenades, that sort of thing. Um, and then two of the squads will have um, three, oh, sorry, four boat guns and pistols, but there'll be a Chain Reaper cannon in it to those squads that you can see there. We then have into the elites, we have ten Chaos Terminators, all with combi bolters and power axes. We then have a Hellbrute with the Twin Last Cannon and Missile Launcher. We then have, for heavy supports, we've got a Havoc squad, five Havocs, and in there there'll be four missile launchers. And then we have a squad of three obliterators with their flesh metal guns and crushing fists. Uh, I should actually have mentioned the Demon Prince psychic power will be Diabolic Strength. Here's my 1500 points of Stygis 8 Admech. I'll be in a battalion detachment, so I've got 12 command points to use in this game. In my HQ, I have a Tip Priest Dominus, Arcane and Mechanicum is going to be Autocadus of Arcanland. Warlord Trait is going to be Divination of the Magos. I also have an Alm Axe, Radication Ray, and Phosphor Serpenta. I've also got a Tip Priest Engines here with Alm Axe, Last Pistol, and Servo Arm. I've then got for my troops a Sky Vanguard Squad, all with Radium Carbines. A Catafron Destroyer Squad, 3 in squads, uh, with Heavy Grav Cannon times 3 and Cognus Heavy Flamer times 3. I've got a unit of five Skatari Rangers, with three of them having Galvanic Rifles and two of them with Transuronic Archibus. I have a unit of Sakaran Infiltrators times five, all armed with Flechette Blasters and Taser Gouds. Got another unit of five Sakaran Infiltrators, all armed with Flechette Blasters and Taser Gouds. Uh, first stack, I've got a unit of six Sidonian Dragoons with Taser Lances and Broad Spectrum Data Tether. And then I've got a Heavy Support. Two Castellan robots with nine, uh, sorry, six heavy phosphor blasters on them. And then I've got Onagar Dune Crawler with Neutron Laser, Cognus Heavy Stubbers, and Broad Spectrum Data Tether. And then I've got Onagar Dune Crawler with Neutron Laser, two Cognus Heavy Stubbers, and a Broad Spectrum Data Tether. That's my 1500 points of Admech. Here is the battle map that we are playing on today. So we've got our Desert Serene with a bunch of our Mechanicum buildings as well. So in this match there's four objective markers. They're actually quite high in this mission. So it's going to take a bit of climbing to get on them. So three of them are a wee bit higher up and one of them is down here. Now we are playing, you know, short edge to short edge. And with that, let's have a look at deployment. So here is the Iron Warriors deployment. We've got a Chaos Space Marines up top, Chaos Space Marines Reaper Chain Cannon on that cliff, Chaos Space Marines Reaper Chain Cannon down here in the rubble, Obliterators, Demon Prince, uh, I'm going to call him Thanos Lord today, he's down there with the Power Fist, the oh, Hellbrute and the Missile Launcher Havocs, and I've got 10 uh, Terminators sitting in uh, reserve, waiting to deep strike in from the Teleportarium. And for the ad admin deployment we have two Onager Dream Growlers on this side, we have our Tet Priest and Castellan Robots just over there with Destroyers nearby. We have our uh, Skatari Rangers and an Engine Seer beside there. 
the ever trusted Stone Edge Goons and a unit of Vanguard on this flank as well. I do have two units of infiltrators, five man squads, waiting to infiltrate their way to the battlefield. So the battle lines are drawn, guys. It's time to roll off and see who goes first. Do you go first? Okay, Ross, you go. Well, that's a one. Uh, I rolled a three. Uh, yeah. So into battle round one, Iron Warriors are going to take turn one. Uh, command phase, I'll go up to 13 command points because I get one refunded because I'm battleforged. Uh, but we don't score any victory points yet, not until battle round two. Uh, it's quite simple really, I need to just move up to get some things in range because the Obliterators need to move up to be able to shoot things. The Havocs are fine, the Hellbrute, I don't know. Uh, I know those Destroyers do a really crazy, scary thing for those Castellan robots, so they're probably our prime target. So it's uh, just the start of a battle round before David's turn. I'm going to use the Stygis uh, Stratum, basically to move on forward nine inches, just bringing me a little bit closer to David's line. And as for my canticles, I'm going to go with Think's Chant for Morseless Fist. Reroll one's to it because, well, I'm going for a bit of a long one charge to get there, though I'll be tightening the, the lines there. But uh, if I get in, then I can do a fair bit of damage. So end of the movement, Obliterators have moved on up to get in range of some targets. We can't really stop being charged potentially next turn, so let's just come forward. Uh, moved up these Chaos Space Marines. Everything here stayed still, uh, and I advanced those Chaos Space Marines to try and get on the objective, but I didn't roll enough, so they're going to have to sit at the foot of that building. That's the end of the movement. I'm actually going to go straight into the Psychic phase. I've got Diabolic Strength in the Demon Prince, but I'm not going to be using that. I'm just going to go straight to Smite, and it's going to be going against that unit there, the Dragoons. Let's go for it. Uh, smite time. Here we get it with D3 Mortal Wounds for two Mortal Wounds on a Dragoon. <laughs> Chaos Space Marines are going to shoot everything into the Vanguard. Yep. Uh, it's minus one to hit because I've moved the Reaper Chain Cannon. You're also Stygies. It's minus two. It's going to be one minus overall. Yeah. Eight shots with the Chain Cannon first. Heading on fours. No rerolls. Solid. Four hits. And... Minus one now would have been a lot more. Yeah. Uh, Reaper Chain Cannon is strength 5, so wounding on 3s uh, for minus 1. Cool, cool, cool. 2 wounds. I'm assuming it's a 5-up five five save. Up save. 1 goes down. And then we've got 4 bolt guns. Uh, again, hit on 4s. For nlch. This Four is the unit, doesn't matter though. 3s uh, to win still. That's a wound. AP dash. 4 up. Nope, another one gone. This unit is going to shoot next. Uh, only that bolt gun and reaper chain cannons in range of your dragoons. That's only viable targets. And I did stay still, so I get to rapid fire, but I'm still minus one to hit. Yep. Uh, let's do the chain cannon first. Your bat should be minus two, but that doesn't work anymore. I'm glad. <laughs> <laughs> uh, fours, no rerolls. So we get three hits. Minus one's already paying off pretty yep, well. Yep, sure is. Dang, man. Uh, fives. I'm assuming you're toughness six. Uh, yes. Says unconfidently, but yes, it wouldn't matter. Would have mattered. And then the two rapid fire bow gun shots, one hit, fives, and uh, no wounds. Havocs are going to shoot all the rockets. We're going to crack rocket into your destroyers. Yep. And the bolt gun from the champions is going to go into the dragons. Go for it. So we'll do the rockets. It's going to be three shots. Four um, shots. Four shots. I'm not going to activate any stratagems here. Okay. Yep. Yeah. Uh, oh. Probably not, because I want to save the damage rerolls for the, the, the what's it called? Hellbrute. Hellbrute, okay. Yeah. Is the Hellbrute Ballistic Skill 3? Uh, it's uh, Ballistic Skill 3. Yeah, I'm going to save it for him. Okay. So these are the rockets. We are going to go into threes to hit, reroll ones. Yep, on the shores. Whoo! Uh, threes to wound, yep. but I do have Siege Master nearby, so I am rerolling wounds one. Yep, so show me all twos. Ooh. There's four wins. Minus two AP. Minus two AP crack. Uh, I'm a six up save. Really? Uh, sorry, four up usually, and then you're minus two. Uh, it's the breachers that are three up ah. saves, and uh, even if I had cover, you ignore it, so that's why I didn't shred some. Sixes! Oh my. Oh, David, right. Uh, How many wins do they have each? Three each. Right, so the first one. Yep, I also had six up bionics, but. It didn't matter. Well, yeah, okay. Because that was an inbuilt. So one's dead. Yep. Two are dead. 
This is pretty Unless much... Unless you get a double one here. Just gonna roll the two of them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oof. Yeah, but yeah, that's three destroyers dead. And then the bolt gun from the champion into the dragoons. Rapid fire stayed still. Yep. Uh, two hits. Fives to win, zero one, Siege Master. Uh, no, you picked up a three there that definitely missed. Oh, yeah, because it's going to be... Yeah, yeah. yeah. So, so it's just one wound. Uh, okay, yeah, because you did actually roll both dice and wound with both. So I'm yeah, going to let that go. Sorry, guys. Uh, four up. Nope, no one down to wounds. So into the obliterators to go next. Now, I actually should have done some of these stratagems already. Not start of the game, but just for the bolt guns and other things that shot these dragoons would have benefited. Yeah. We're going to put tank hunters for one command point on these because they're a vehicle. So it means the rest of my Iron Warriors units, when they shoot against them, get real wounds. Crazy. As that is a very good strategy. We have read it, and yes, that is, that yes. You basically choose a unit of vehicles, or a vehicle. And you can do it in the shooting or the fight phase. You can do it in the fight phase too. Uh, basically, the rest of my army now shots that shoot them are going to get real wounds. Wow. I'm going to Vets of the Long War, the Obliterators. Um, yeah. to give them plus one to their wound yep. and I'm going to rampant techno virus them so I can uh, re-roll their d3 dice for determining uh, strength, AP and damage. Yeah. Let's go straight into that. So strength one doesn't matter? No, but we'll roll it anyway. Yeah, because either way you roll this you're going to be wounding on yeah. twos. So fits. strength seven, AP, AP minus three. Right, brings me to bionics. And damage. That's where you need the three. Damage Four. three. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Let's get the dice. I've got it here. Right, David. So you got yep. 18 shots. Yep. You're going to be like forced to hit. Reroll one's fine. Two's to wound. AP minus three and three damage. And reroll off the wounds. Oh, right. I need you to roll twos and yeah. threes for me, buddy. I actually don't need the tank hunters here, technically, because I've got... Oh, no, I do, because no, Siege do. Master's not packed. No, Siege Master wouldn't impact So them. you want twos, yeah. Twos, please. Twos and threes. Twos and threes. Okay. Uh, force you. to hit because of minus one and reroll hits of one. I think I see a lot of twos and threes, mm, Ross. Yeah. That's clearly cocked. Oh, that minus yeah, one. That has just it's paid. paid off really well for you. Yeah. Yeah, only. Technically, it'd be minus two if it was the old edition, yeah. but. So far, we only get seven hits through. Right, okay, there's so many threes there, it was unbelievable. Yeah, that, that, was, that minus has paid yeah. off. Uh, reroll for fours. Reroll fours. Which, yeah, okay. sure. So we get, what, uh, nine hits? Okay, okay. So half them have hit, yep. and I'm going to be twos to win re-rollable. Yep. Okay. It's looking great. So that's eight wins so far. Mm -hmm. uh, it's going to be straight to your six up bionics. Six up bionics. Three damage apiece. <laughs> yeah, you're looking at that. I this is going to hurt David. Oh! <laughs> so one dies. One dies. Two die. Three die, four die. Uh, do they explode? Four explosion rolls. I'll do one at a time, technically. <laughs> One's exploded. So that's one down. Narwins. Nah. 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 So there's. Is that two left? Did it catch that unit? Uh, no, I think it's like three inches. Is it three inch explosion? Yeah, it's really, it's really okay. small. It's only one more kill. Cool. So four have died, and one's down to five wounds. And then on to the Hellbrute, and I'm going to Fire Frenzy the Hellbrute, mm -hmm. and I'm going to Methodical Annihilation, an Iron Warrior stratagem, for two command points in total for all of them. So I can shoot everything twice at the closest enemy unit if I didn't move, which will be them. Yep. And I get to reroll all the damage results. Yeah, and you still get to reroll the wounds. Because of Tank Hunters, which just stays on them for this phase. Yep. Uh, let's just go straight to the... The missile launchers, I guess. Yep, go for missile. Going to do two crack missiles. Yep, so that's going to be four zero ones. Yeah, four zero ones. Okay. Yep, and then four last cannons. Yep, because the fire frenzy. Now, if you do that again, I'd be really yeah. nice. Oh. You know what? It's it's fair. <laughs> <laughs> it's fair. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. One hit. Sure. 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 Okay, Hellbrook, we don't like you anymore. Yeah, uh, th uh, three's to wins. Three's to win, reroll. Yep. Minus two, six, six up. Six up. It's minus three for last cannons. Nah, take it, David. You get reroll damage, don't yeah, you? Yeah, so you need a five plus, because yep. I've got methodical annihilation. Nope, I'm going to reroll that. Well, I'll get to it anyway. Yeah. Yep. Does he explode? Does he explode? Nah. Nope. 
And at the end of the shooting phase, I'm going to use Endless Cacophony for two command points, and I'm going to choose the Slaneshi Obliterators to shoot again. Uh, we've just checked, we don't have to do any rerolls for their abilities, they keep everything that's on there. Yep. So six of the shots are going to go into him, mm -hmm. and twelve of the shots that can see are going into the Castellan robots. Sorry, yeah, twelve of the shots into them. Yep. So I'll do the six into him first of all. Yep. Heading on fours, reroll ones. Oh my lord. Oh my, like, I'm trying to stack as much minus ones as I could for this. Uh, wow. Yep. Whoa. It just happened. Whoa. Uh, twos, and I've still got everything else on, so twos reroll everything. Yeah. Ones. Yep. It's yep, I've got to make all, all but them. one. Yeah. He's mm. so toast. toast. It's unbelievable. Does he explode? Nope. Nope, but that's the Dragoon's gone. And we're filming. And then the other 12 shots into the Castellan robots. Um, yep. I've got everything except for tank hunters on this time. Yeah. So we are hitting on fours. Three to ones. It's actually not bad. Yeah. I'm not going to complain about that. Yeah. If there was threes, you'd only <coughs> have had one miss. Yeah. And oh. A bunch of hits here. Yep. And with Vets still being on, I normally wouldn't on 4s because I was strength 7 with these guns. Yep. But I'm at uh, 3s because of Vets. Yeah, and you won't get to reroll though because no. they're attack hunters. Siege Master doesn't also affect them either because yeah. they have to be Havocs or vehicles. So just 3s uh, to wind. Yeah, no, yeah, it's okay. So there's 5 wins um, at minus 3 AP. So that's going to bring me to my 4 up invul. Yes. So 4 up invul and 6s bounce back a mortal wind here. Oh boy. Uh, I need to re right, so you get one more wound. I need to reroll one of these. I Why? Need, uh, are you not three damage piece? Yeah, I, I'm always going to kill one regardless. Yeah, but if I don't reroll one, you're going to destroy both of them. No, I won't. Well, three wounds. Yeah, so your six wounds yeah. kills one, brings one to half wounds. That was also part of it. That's a five year old. Oh, right, was it? Oh, goodness. Yeah, yeah so, so you're past. Oh, okay. So I'm saying don't reroll. There's yeah, no yeah. need to reroll. Yeah, okay, that's fine. So one stays alive. With three wounds. And do you explode? I hope not. No. So that brings an end to Iron Warriors turn one, and I think we're both in a little bit of shock. I think that went a bit better than expected. Yeah. Especially with the, the minus one stacking, which Obliterators apparently didn't care for. Uh, if you look at the board, there's a massive... Uh, the Destroyers are dead, the Dragoons are dead, and a Castellan Robot's already died. I'm pretty sure I actually have to do a morale for them. Uh, you only lost two guys. Yeah, okay, I think I'm fine. Uh, so you're no, eight here for leader. Yeah, yeah you're fine. absolutely fine. Woo! Um, with that, guys, I'm down to six command points remaining after all those stratagems I threw out there. Let's yep. hand it on to Abmech, turn one. Abmech, turn one. Wow, David, uh, that ripped through me. Losing one of the robots and all Macedonia Dragoons, it hurts. I'm not going to lie, I'm probably more excited to see your second salvo. I'm just going to move on forward, hopefully do some damage and see how we do. So I have moved my forces forwards, dune crawlers a wee bit here. Basically, I'm just going for damage, <laughs> trying to do what I can. So. Everything has moved on slightly, just getting to better range. Tech Priest Dominus is going to be the Overlord safeguards from the Divination, and that will allow me to get a bit more hits, hopefully. Speaking of which, let's go into do some shooting. Just at the end of the movement phase, I am going to activate Benharic Override. That will change his protocol into, uh, I think, is it the one that basically double shots? Yes. Because I'll need to lay down some firepower. Going to do the Vanguard first. Nine shots into these Chaos Marines. Yep. Any shots, hint on threes. Okay, okay. Wounding you on fives, sixes are uh, two damage, but I don't cool. think that affects you. So it is five, yeah. three wounds. Any AP? Nope. So three up armor saves. Go for it. Just putting this in the normal Marines, guys. Yeah. Yeah, fine. So Cassell Robot, I did change his protocol, is going to fire all the shots at the Havocs. Really need to whisk down some of those missile shots. Gonna be 18 shots coming your way. Yeah, I'm gonna for one command point do our duty mm -hmm. to give them a uh, for shots against that unit will reduce your AP by minus one. Okay, it so will mean I'm AP minus one and I ignore your cover. Better so than AP minus two. Yes, this is true. Right, so it's gonna be 18 shots hitting on fours and I'm near the Dominus, so reroll ones. And I think if I get sixes 
on modified, uh, scores one additional hit. Cool. Keep track of the sixes. So I'm going to quickly reroll the ones. Yep. Just do that for me. But there are loads of six there, so I'm going to have yeah, to calculate that out. So we've got June Crawlers next. Neutron laser straight into the Blair Rares. Try and at least kill one, two, or maybe possibly three. And then the Kong's Heavy Stubbers into those Havocs. Yeah. Each missile kill is pretty good. Got it. Neutron laser first, D3 shots. Not ideal, but I've got our neutron okay, laser. Okay, that's fine. So, you know. Three step reroll ones, don't roll twos. Reroll ones because of the Tech Priest. Sixes would be an additional hit. Okay. It's going to be strength 10. Believe your toughness five. five, so two's to win. Two's to win, mate. Yep, there we go. Minus four AP, demon save. Five of demon save coming right your way. Nope. Nope, so it's D6 damage, minimum three. Uh, I think you've got four wounds now. So that's just gonna be three wounds. And I ignore sixes? Yep. Nope, don't count drop that. So yeah, yeah, three wounds, ignore sixes. So I've got two wins remaining on the one of the obliterators. See if you were for like five <clears throat> to ignore, I would have uh, yeah, I know. <laughs> single wins. Uh, and your heavy stubber? Uh, heavy stubber, yep. So this is six shots, because there's two of them. Yep. Let's go into the Havoc, so now you're yeah. going to begin covering stuff, but each missile is a good one. Yeah, yeah. Threes to hit, reroll once. And sixes are extra hits. Uh, six are additional hits, so reroll that one. So that's technically all hit. Uh, plus Three one. and plus one more. And it's going to be four swinger. Yep. Three wins. Three wins. Two up save behind Barcade. Two ups. Saved. Second neutron laser straight into blurs, of course. And, and then the Cognus straight into missiles. Missiles. Uh, let's D6 shots. Uh, D3 shots. D3. D3. <laughs> yep. Yes. That's good. Three shots. Hit on. Uh, sorry. Hit on uh, threes. We roll ones and sixes are an additional shot. Oh, oh the twos. No, so you're not going to kill more than one obliterator. Well, uh, it's going to be two to wound. Yep. Yeah. Five up. Demon save. Demon save. Oh. oh. And Subber straight into those. Just got killed. At least one more missile would be yeah. nice. Going to hit on threes. We do one. Six is our additional hit. Oh. Okay. Oh. No ideal. Four hits. Four to wounds. Yeah. Uh, there we go. Two ups. Two up. Double one. No. Oh. Forgot to mention that these robots are getting repaired by a tech priest engines here and back up to five, five wounds. Yeah. So these rangers here, I'm pretty, pretty much going to put all the shots into the blarriers because I'm kind of in range. I really just need to kill one or two. Only one of them is in range to get the additional shots if they roll a six based on that transonic archivist. So it's dogs. not the unit, it's models then? It's the model. Ah. Yeah, so, but it's, the whole unit's going to get reroll ones from Yeah, it. that's fine. So I'm going to do the galvanic rifles first because okay. I'm not holding out much for that. So these don't get the sixes then? No, so three to reroll ones. Well, I wasn't holding out much for them. Okay. And it's going to be five to yeah. Sixes are minus one AP. No. Two transonic archivists. So the one that's not going to get an additional hit, threes. Yep. And the one that is going to get an additional hit if I get a six. Nope. Uh, strength seven, so it's threes to wound. Yeah, three's to uh, Sixes are mortal wounds in addition. Nice. Mortal wound already uh, is minus two AP. So I'm down to one wound remaining. Okay, oh no. Uh huh. And yeah, so it's uh, minus two brings me to four up, I believe. Four up, save. Four up. It's D3 damage, not that matter. Oh. So it's still alive. That is the end of turn one for the Admech. Oh no, like the yeah. Iron Warriors proved, you know, Iron within, Iron without. They ain't going down. You do have a morale. Oh, morale, let's do that just now, guys. Yeah, yeah. Um, we've got to check the leadership of the Havocs without the sergeant. It might be seven. Roll the dice and we'll see how we do. Okay. Uh, so I lost three, didn't I? You yeah. lost six here. I'm pretty confident you've failed. I rolled a five, five plus a three, three brings me to eight, so there's a chance I might have failed. Chance. Let's have a double check. So, yes, leadership seven without the sergeant. So that was a fail. I'm going to command point it. Yeah. You know, one, two, three, or four. Yep. Nailed Fine. Nope. Let's just reverse the setting to your Ross. Yeah, no, you cannot do that. So, so one is going to go. And on a one or two, the other one will go. Go away. He's alive. The two, the, the one I roll for the morale, I'm not going to count no, that no, as no. that roll, if that's no, okay. No, no. So one's alive. Well, even with that additional missile going, uh, you've still got 10 Terminators coming down. This is going to be carnage. Go on, David. Show us what the Iron Warriors can do.
So into battle round two, we can start claiming points. Now, I only hold... Do I hold any objectives, actually? I do. I hold one up in that cliff. Yep. So I believe I'm going to get five victory points, and that's it. I don't think you really... Care. Care. <laughs> no. I think... Uh, no. You've done the damage, David. I think it's time you cause yeah. some more. So into the end of the movement phase, I've dropped my Terminators down here in the back lines of the Abmec. Uh, move these guys on up. Demon Prince has jumped on up. Obliterators move forward to get line of sight. Everything here has kind of stayed still. The Lord's just coming into view so you guys can see him. And uh, these Marines have moved on to that objective. Into the Psychic phase, my Doom Prince is going to Diabolic Strength. We fail it. <laughs> yeah. I'm filming. These Marines are going to shoot everything at the Vanguard. Yeah. Reaper Chain Cannon. Yeah. I'm minus one to hit because I moved. Yeah. I'm now within your Stedges range. Uh oh. Uh, hitting on fours, no rerolls. Not that I really needed it. Um, and it's threes to wound for minus one, but you are in cover. Uh, two wounds, minus one. Uh, four up saves. Yep. Uh, you ignore cover. Oh, I do. So, uh, so it'd be four, five, uh, so five one so dice still. still. One dice. And then we've got the bolt guns. Yep. I do ignore cover. Uh, eight shots to the rapid fire bolt guns. Hit normally now because I'm within 12 inches. Mm -hmm. So threes to hit. Sure. And then we are threes to wound. So you've lost one so far. Yep. Okay. Oh man. Four's, uh, four up saves. Yeah. Four up saves. So that unit's gone. Yeah, that unit's gone. We're going to go with the Havoc. And we're actually going to use a stratagem just now on this on our Doom Crawler. We're going to tank hunt him. Yep. So any remaining shots against him by my army. Uh, I'm going to get reroll wounds. <laughs> uh, so we're going to go with the missile first of all. Yep. Into him. So hitting on threes, reroll ones. Hitting on fours, reroll Hitting on ones. fours, you're totally right. Well, reroll that one. Two or four. No. Nope. Oh, look at that minus one. Yeah. Pain off. So I'm going to use the obliterators next. And we're going to use techno virus for one command point to reroll their number of dice determining stuff. Yep. And we'll do that before I choose a target. Yep. So strength. I'm going to reroll that. Yeah, sure. So strength nine. Lovely. Uh, AP. Minus two. Against most things, I'm either going to be a five up save or six it's up It's actually save. not going to make a difference. We'll keep the minus two. Yeah, because they've actually got five up yeah. angles. Yep. Keep the minus two, but damage, want some high. I'm going to reroll it. I'm going to be greedy. Ooh. Yes. Oh, okay. So they're strength nine, minus two AP, and three damage apiece. Um, I'm actually going to also Vets of Long War them for mm -hmm. another command point. Okay. So down to two command points to get plus one to the wound. So you're going to wound anything pretty much in twos? Yeah, I'm going to do... I'm actually going to do six of the shots onto him. So no, six onto him. Mm -hmm. and then we're going to do 12 onto him. Cool. So the six shots probably from the front guy is within short range? Yeah, we checked that. Uh, the rest, however, will be minus one. Okay, so we do so, him first. Yeah, we'll do the one with the front. So hitting on three zero ones because I'm within 12 inches. Yep. Didn't, didn't matter. Didn't matter. Uh, threes to wind. Two's now to down wind. to two because of it. So they all wind. Yep. Uh, I'm going to be five up. Invo. And sixes reflect. Ah, uh, <laughs> there's no point in I mean, how much damage is that? That's. Uh, no, uh, yeah, I can't reroll one. It's. Uh, that's 15 damage. Is, is three damage per one? Yeah. Two, six. Oh my word. Does it explode? Why? No. no. Let's just get the rest of the shots done. Oh boy. So we've this is the tank concerts? Yeah, but I'm minus one to hit here. Yeah. So six, three, and another three. So 12 shots. Fours, reroll ones, because I do have the Doom Prince kicking around. Yep. Fours, reroll ones. Ooh. Ugh. Let's take out the twos and threes. Yeah. Not good. Yep. Oh, that's dead. Yep. Thanks, yeah. <laughs> Okay. Okay. It's quite good. Yep. Uh, and then these are winding on twos, rerollable. Yeah, they are indeed. Because of Tank Hunter and Vets. Thank God for Tank Hunter and uh, Vets. Yep, so they all win. Uh, five, five up, up. Invil, which I get to reroll once because I'm near another uh, yeah. Doom Crawler. Oh, that's just potentially. It has just blown up. I mean, that's that. 15 you damage. You can't get much worse than that. 
Ah, uh, in core well, yeah. Oh my word. Uh, Hellbrook's going to shoot everything into the Honor Gardoon Crawler. I'm not going to fire Frenzy because I won't take advantage of it. Yeah, because we'll go for the ninja yeah. here. Let's go with the twin last cannon first of all. Yep. Hitting on threes, reroll ones, hitting on fours, reroll ones. Kill. Oh, this minus one has not paid off. No, it's been criminal how it hasn't <laughs> paid off. Uh, threes to wound, but I'll reroll wins a one because of Siege Master. You will indeed. No okay. cape. Okay. Minus three. Three, five up, and just five up. Nope. D6 damage. D6, this the missiles, and isn't it? I've used Methodical Annihilation, yep. so I get to reroll the damage. Wait, no, that's the last cans, wasn't it? Yeah. Yep, cool. D6 rerollable. Yep. Rerollable. Methodical Annihilation. For four damage. Okay, down to, I think, uh, six or seven. Yeah. Yep. Crack Missile. Go for it. That's Cops. clearly caught. Fours. Uh, nope. And uh, I believe my shooting phase might be over. No, David, you've uh, you've got a few more. Yeah, we're going to go with the Terminators, and they're going to shoot everything into them. Right. Uh, Ever? For, uh, okay, so that's... Uh, well, I think that's only a viable target. Can you not go for the Doom Crawler? Which is going to bounce all the bolt gun shots. Yeah, probably. Let's try and just kill them. Just annihilate them. I need them. 40 shots. Okay. 40 combi bolter shots. Is it 40? Yeah, 10 times 4. Yeah into them, you're going to get no cover. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hitting on threes. We'll be right back. Probably. Got a good bunch of hits there. Uh, threes to wind. Need cover, because you no. are iron warriors. Okay, that's a lot of wounds. Uh, do you want me to get them off you? Yep, please, man. Uh, so I'm assuming these are four up saves. Mm-hmm. I think this squad might hurt. Uh, I don't think they'll hurt, because to hurt, you need to be alive! Definitely. It's actually not that bad a roll. Uh, no, they're dead. No, they're dead. Yeah, yeah five. Gone, an additional one, and... Uh, nah, yeah, dead. And last to shoot is those marines on that building. They're just out of rapid fire range of the Honor Doom Crawler, so five shots. Yep. Hitting on fours. Winding on fives. Nope. And I'm going to charge the Demon Prince into him. Yep. So 9 inch charge, you're not going to overwatch, are you? No, I'm not going to. With a last pistol? Nah. Nah. Nope. And. Uh, what do you want to spec? I've got one command point do left. It, so do, it, do it, do it, do it. Right, re rollable. It's not any better. Not going to happen. Uh, 9 inch charge from here into sure. them. Sure. Oh, that's oh, enough five five as well. <laughs> so that would have been a. Oh, oh. Yeah, that would have been, but. Uh, yeah, it's fine. It is the way it is. So that's the end of Iron Warriors Battle Round. Sorry, turn two. Um, David, no. it's done. Good game. Yeah. <laughs> wow. So, guys, thanks for watching. Um, it was short and carnage. Oh. Yes. Uh, yeah, I was a bit I was a bit surprised. I thought all the minuses to hit yep. factored in. Um, might have helped. It might have helped, but the, the rolling was really high. That was some of your really best high. rolling in a while. Now to give you a bit of backdrop on this one, uh, I actually wrote both these lists because we when we're preparing and everything, sometimes we share on it. I know the Chaos Space Marine sort yeah. of roster we've got the most, and I sort of wrote it. And I was like, ah, oh, David likes this unit, likes this unit. Not really used the blur rays very much, and it was. Uh, Given a chance to try some different things. Yeah, I really maybe should have calmed it down slightly. Yeah. That one was a little bit... I mean, I didn't think... like We've had Chaos and Admit. Good thing is, in this one, is that they've both had a bit of a hard time in the sort of first couple of battle reports. So it's good to have one of them win. But I didn't think Chaos could do that well. Like, that, that was I, some Primaris level shoot. That was... Um, I would say, though, that list non-Iron Warriors would not have achieved what it did yeah that if you put the iron warriors with all those inc they are incredible stratagems mm. the iron warriors have so cheap so effective and they all have their purpose yep um those obliterators as well when i did roll for their abilities i think i got three damage every time yeah which is critical and I, also criminal i can't stress how much that hurts because i remember in a very older battle report i think it was i was playing tau you're playing 
uh, chaos, and you just had a blur errors, and I, I think again you didn't fail to get three damage. No, I didn't fail. Versus one time when I was a blur errors facing Tao, and I couldn't even take out a devil fish. No, I remember with that. two rounds of shooting, yeah. and I think I used uh, shoot twice, twice. I think you did, yes. And uh, uh, sometimes you make me jealous, David. Sometimes you make me jealous. Um, I would say the list you've made, I loved it. Yeah. And I'd like personally, I'd like you to take hands of it and try it against something that you'd like to face with that list. I'm not going to use that mix, we're not going to flip it around. No. I don't know what mix. No, There's you don't know what mix at all. No. <laughs> but, um, we can maybe think about something that we think could match up against it, because that was a really fun list as well. I know it was a short game there, but I had a lot of fun actually using it. There's a lot of cool synergy, a lot of stuff. And normally when I play Iron Warriors, I like tanks. I yeah. You gave me one vehicle there. Well, I also tried to make it so you didn't have last time where you were yes. you were at one point three three roll ones and two three roll ones on vehicles with D six damage. Like, no, yeah. David, none of that predator no, no, stuff. No, no, no. And I limited the access to rerolls, and you still nailed it. Yeah, I know. Minuses <laughs> to hit. Yeah, with minuses to hit. But it's a, what you've designed. There's a really fun list. Yeah, it's, not yeah, bad. it's a really good list. It's got a good spread of all different options. One thing I did notice as well is I would normally play chaos. I like to take a lot of cultists. Mm -hmm. Utilisation of cultists versus just five space marines now. I prefer playing space marines and cultists. Space marines work. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I'm glad to, to hear you. that chain reaper can and stick it in there's brilliant. Well, stick yourself in cover and you're also hard to shift. That's very point. Yep. Yes. You probably achieve more than you would with cultists, just a bit more expensive. Yeah. So, guys, I hope you enjoyed that. It was short, we apologise for that, but um, blame Ross for making that list. My bad. That was a good list. My bad. My, well done me. <laughs> <laughs> um, check us and likes down below for Patreon to support the channel, along with uh, all the social media stuff that we're up to, to stay up to date with it all. Comment, share, like and subscribe, and we hope to see you again on one of our Tabletop Salt Battle Reports.